Hey guys, what is up? Cody Carter coming at you once again. Another episode of Cody Eats. So, today we've got another spicy, another spicy one. So we've got Popcorners Spicy Queso. So, in reality, I don't foresee these being super hot. Um, they just look really good. So they'll probably be a little spicy, a little cheesy. Uh, but they looked good. So it's like a popcorn <laughs> snack. So, once again, not open. I've been I've been dying to try these because they've been just sitting on my shelf like mocking me. Just like, hey, eat me, eat me, because it actually looks really good. Um, I hope this microphone is fine. I put it a little lower. Like a weird textured bag. It smells like jalapenos and stale popcorn. Almost like a rice cake rather than a popcorn. I'm nervous. I'm nervous that this isn't gonna work. Eh, screw it. So that's what it looks like on the inside, if, if you can see. Let's see. Nothing special, but it looks like a rice cake. Not bad. Not bad at all. I, I it, the picture on the front is deceiving because this almost looks like a tortilla chip, like a Dorito. But these definitely have a rice cake esque texture. Not a bad taste. I do like them. I guess if you were looking for something that you could trick yourself into thinking was healthier. Well, I mean, I guess it's not that bad. There's not a whole lot in here. Hardly any, hardly any um, heat. I mean, we're talking like a 0.5. But they're not bad. Not what I expected. I really wanted like a like a tortilla chip type texture. So if you don't like rice cakes, don't eat these. But yeah, not bad. Would I buy them again? Yeah, yeah, maybe. I would try their other flavors, and these are good flavors. I would just rather have like a jalapeno Dorito. If I'm going to have something. Taste overall. Yeah, same. About a six. Six isn't bad. It's like middle of the road, up a step. You know what I mean? It's like, eh, plus one. So it's, they taste pretty good. Six and a half. I go solid six and a half. Um, heat point. Two five. There's basically nothing spicy about them, but in all honesty, yeah, I'd probably buy these again. Six and a half, solid six and a half. Wouldn't go so far. No, yeah, six and a half seven. I want to be fair. Six and a half out of seven, or not six and a half out of seven. Six and a half seven out of ten. Um. Heat, yeah, basically non-existent heat. Even on ones like this that look super orange. Point two five, But it just kind of freaks me out because since they're, excuse me, since they're, um, they're not actually chips, they're like pressed corn, they're all exactly the same size. So this one's broken. Here. So they're all exactly the same size, exactly the same shape. So, I mean, I kind of like the natural variation, I mean, like regular chips or Doritos. They have the folded ones, you know, some are bigger, some are smaller. But I do like rice cakes. I'm a rice cake fan. So, six and a half, seven, six point seven five. How's that? And then heat. Like it's not even there. Well, 
I don't want to say not there because that's not fair. It's there. It's just not strong at all. I mean, it's just like if you like something that's barely registerable, regi regi barely heat heated heat. Uh, but, 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 but. If you like something that's barely on the heat scale, go for these. Go for these. They taste good. There's not a lot of calories. I mean, almost 20 chips and you get 170 calories. So really, they're a lot better than chips. They're not fried. Non-GMO corn. So yeah, I'll give them a thumbs up. I'd buy them again. I would definitely also try their other flavors because I, these were pretty good. But that's about it. Thanks for watching another episode Cody Eats. Uh, if you guys have anything else you want me to test out, try, taste, uh, I am excited for the next one because I've got this ghost pepper Chex mix. So this is uh, supposed to be scary hot according to the little scale. We're not doing that now. Um, we're going to do that next time. So I just wanted you guys to give a little heads up. Um, like I said, think of anything, throw it in the comments. And uh, remember, it's your life. Live it.